Oh, Guess we what? Love it. We love it. Can you hear that? Or did you hear that? So this morning we're celebrating Man's Best Friend in honor of National Dog Day, which is tomorrow. But our furry friends also need our help because the number of dogs in shelters has shot up by 100,000 over the last year alone. Every year, more than 450 dogs mm, they are put to sleep because there's just no more room in those shelters. And that's an average of 20 dogs every hour. The Best Friends Animal Society has a goal to have no-kill shelters by 2025. <laughs> So that, yeah, see, exactly. That's in a year and a half. Alina Hopnin from the Best Friends Animal Society is here to tell us just exactly how we can help reach that goal. And obviously, as you can hear, she didn't come yes. empty handed. I'm going to pick you up. Yes. Right? Okay, Hello. so good morning to you guys morning. and all of our furry friends that are with us this morning. Okay, I'm, I have a bad back, otherwise, I would love to hold one right now, but I'm just I in pain. Uh, tell us a little bit, for, first and foremost, about what you're seeing in the shelter system right now, right? Because they're kind of at capacity. Yes, so all shelters are over capacity right now, which is incredibly sad. Like you mentioned, 100,000 dogs. Additional dogs came into the shelters in 2022 alone, according to Best Friends Animal Society data. Yeah. And, you know, adoptions for dogs have stalled at around 1 million. Mm -hmm. And sadly, industry data is also showing that more people are buying from pet stores and yeah. breeders. So, you know, there are so many dogs you can see from today who are ready and willing mm -hmm. to go to homes you can find whatever you're looking for. So yeah, choose the adoption option. Yeah, yes. so, so what is Best Friends Animal Society doing exactly to, to make sure that they find homes? Sure, so we work with a network of over 4,300 shelters and rescue groups and we're trying to get them to no kill. Yeah. No kill yeah. means that you have a 90% save rate and that's, you know, allowing for 10% if an animal is very, very sick or has severe behavioral problems. Mm -hmm. And we're working to get those 4,300 and every other shelter and rescue group to no kill. And right now we have 57% of shelters. Wow. That's amazing. That yes. Um, adoption, not the only option for people at home though too, right? Because there's a whole foster to adopt situation that you guys provide as well. Absolutely. So there's so many different ways you can help. <laughs> You can foster, and when you do, all the fees are covered. So oh, you're wow, really okay. giving the dog or cat time to decompress, which is amazing and makes them... Out of the shelter. Exactly. Right. And then you can also volunteer. That's an amazing way to, to help. And then you can donate, and you can donate monetary, but you can also donate in kind. So yeah. rugs, blankets, food, litter. Right. Wee wee pads. Yeah, oh gosh. Exactly. Wee wee, wee wee pads. pads. Everyone loves those. the wee wee pads. Oh, yes. So let's uh, go through who we got here yeah, today. We, Look we at these to cute get little to faces. The, the stars of the show today. Sure. So, right here, I have Coco Puff. Coco Puff oh, is Coco Puff. four months old, and she is an adorable puppy. Oh. We think she has some Australian Shepherd in her, and oh, she yeah. is just, you know, pretty. ready to go to a home who can train her. She's so we pretty. have. Look at her eyes. I know, the eyes are gorgeous. So sweet. And how big do you think she will get? We it's don't know. hard to guess because these are all, you know, super mutts. Right. But, yeah. um, that was like she's Bella, four, my dog. Four months, so, you know, she'll be a, a medium. medium. I was told anywhere medium from. Medium large. My, for my dog, Bella, when I got her, she was four months old, 40 to 75 pounds. We're just That's not a sure. big range. Like, oh, okay. <laughs> Over here this? we have the Hunger Games girls. Oh, so we have Katniss oh, and we have goodness. Primrose. They are both four months old and ready to take on the Big Apple. Uh, so they can be adopted together face. or separately. Hi, oh, look at, oh my goodness. But oh, they're, look, they're related. look at how cute they need yeah. to be together. Oh my God, look, at that. look at that right there. <laughs> come, oh, on. come on. Stop Don't it right now. Okay, and, and then my and buddy over here. Hi. Your buddy is our distinguished gentleman. Hi, this you're is so Jason. Distinguished. You're so distinguished. Jason is 11 years old. Oh. Yes, Jason. Seniors are amazing. He has a slight harm, heart murmur, but that okay. doesn't slow him down a bit. Yeah, look at that. Look how calm he is. And yes, one of the many benefits of a senior. Yes, <laughs> you're going my speed right now, Jason. Me this and you. is so great. So wh how, <laughs> what is the best way, though, then that somebody can get involved and, or at least come in and, and bring one of these little lovelies home? Yeah. I mean, stop by best friends sent life saving center at 307 west broadway we're open from noon to six every day and you can check out spend time with the dogs or also just go to your local shelter right you know mm -hmm. dogs and cats need your help right yes. now and you know it's just the perfect time to get out there 
and bring home that special furry somebody. You know, I always wonder when you, when adoptions take place, right, and you, and you get some of these these um, animals into homes, loving homes. How quickly do you get more into the shelter system to kind of keep it all moving? It, pretty quickly, yeah. but you know, it, it depends because we also do a lot of transport. Right. So if there's areas that are overcrowded, you know, you take we take them in, or we're able to occasionally pull when there's you know a yeah. high kill situation. Mm. Because there are so many shelters across the country and here in New York City that are completely overcrowded. Yes. The yes, other yes, thing yes. is it's clear the shelters right now. Yeah. So if you do come to Best Friends through August. All dogs, cats, and kittens are fee waived, and puppies. Wow! So these three little guys would be fifty dollars. Oh, amazing! Oh, wow. That's fantastic. Oh, it really is such great work that you do. And even yeah, if you people want to foster, go. if you have a pet and you can foster, is a good way to help as well. Uh, it's an amazing way. And fostering look, is so needed. One of my friends did a fostering situation and then became the <laughs> adopted parent of a yeah, dog. It's a foster they were, win. Yeah, they yes, were like, oh, we love is. the dog. Can't give it back now. Well, um, we are both parents of rescue, so yes. I love that. we're very part, to, very yes. proud to be involved yes, in this yes, as yes. well. But listen, look at these faces. I they know. need a we're home. Hi, Jason. So sweet. Me and Jason. So, um, again, you can reach out to the folks at the Best Friends Animal Society. They are open, as she said, every day from noon to 6 o'clock. All dogs and cats go home for free this month um, for the clear of the shelters. There is a $50, though, adoption fee for these puppies. Yes, very and nice. Seriously, come come closer. Yeah, I know. Get this seriously. Get this face. Can you... Can you Look at that. Can you stand That's it? Just, oh my I can't goodness. stand it. Stacey oh Ann is like, goodness. all right, where do I sign up? Right? Do we have an adopted parent? Are, oh, are we here? Craig, come, come on, Craig. Craig. Come on, Are you going to come get one? <laughs> Let's see them. Come here, buddy. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Go right on over. Oh That's right. Goodness. Just take one. Well, this is, Craig's going to be the adopted. <laughs> there you go, Craig. I know. Craig, I think they found. Oh, there we go, sweet. Craig. Looks like there a match go. made in heaven. Stacy Ann. Looks like come a match. Stacy Ann. Oh. You're, you're, you're tempting. It's very tempting, but I have to do some there, research first. <laughs> It's like a child. Go ahead, Stacey Ann. Take it, it away. You know, it's, it's really easy. Yes. Yes. 